Indianapolis mother on edge after hearing that someone tried to get into her neighbor's home and then target her family. It happened at a reportedly upscale apartment complex known as the Oaks of Eagle Creek. It's located on the northwest side. Our crime beat reporter Steve Jefferson is there tonight to explain what happened next that led this criminal to turn violent. This was a very scary situation. First, the suspect tried to get into this apartment on this side and then moved to this apartment on this side, and that's when things really got dangerous. It's a good, you know, neighborhood. I don't understand. Out of fear, Taquita asked Eyewitness News not to show her face while talking about a Thursday afternoon attempted burglary. She moved here to the Oaks of Eagle Creek to be safe, but after a strange knock at their door. Well, my boyfriend tried to ask him, who he was, he never responded. He still was trying to get in with the crowbar. So in the mix of that going on, my boyfriend opens up the door and he had a gun. So my boyfriend slams the door back. The would-be burglar eventually took off running, and that's when Taquita's boyfriend gave chase, trying to see his face. And when my boyfriend I tried to identify him, he shot at him. Responding Metro officers learned the same man banged on her neighbor's door just across the hall and blocked the peephole. The neighbor showed oh, Eyewitness weird. News paper she found stuck to her peephole using saliva. Outside, police found shell casings and the burglar's crowbar he dropped it during the getaway. Now, Taquita is taking steps to keep her family safe. It's just best for people to just get an alarm system so they can protect themselves and their homes. If you have any information on what happened inside this apartment complex, call Crime Stoppers. The telephone number is 317-262-TIPS on the Crime Beat. I'm Steve Jefferson.